Michelle Cromer, and this is your tip and question of the week. Michelle, last year I went through a breakup. I wish my ex well and just want him to be happy. But try as I might, I can't get this man out of my mind or out of my heart. Any suggestions would be greatly appreciated. Thank you. This is a real tough one. I mean, this is, this is real. This is, um, this is a lot. I want to commend you for surrounding your ex with love, wishing him well and happiness bodes so well of you and your self-esteem. And that's very admirable. And I know people have been telling you since it was last year, oh, you know, just, you know, get on with it. It's, you know, it's okay. So often we try to make other people feel better by minimizing their pain, by telling them it's going to get better, which it will, or that things in the world could be a lot worse, which they could be, but that's not what you need to hear. What I want to say is it still hurts because it mattered. So other than the obvious physical things, remove photos, objects, any gifts that this man has given you, put them in a box, get that cheat out of your house, give it to your mom, give it to your best friend, just move it out. Put it in another place. I, I don't know what to tell you. I, you can't force yourself not to think about this person because if you force yourself, it's going to have the opposite effect. I don't know a lot. I, I hardly know anything at all, really, but I do know this. One day, you're going to walk into a cafe, and that man you're supposed to meet will be there. It's as simple as that. He will be sitting with his head in a book. He'll turn to look up at you, and it will slowly begin. When love finds you next time, it won't come with crashing waves or thunderbolts. It will appear like a song on the radio or a particular blue in the sky. It will dawn on you slowly like a warm winter sunrise where the promise of summer shines out from within. We number our days, we divide our seasons, we endlessly define what it is to be in love. When the truth is, spring blurs into summer and it always has, long before that line was ever drawn. Your love for him will be the same, wild and free, like the air around you. It will stretch across the world and will leave not one single thing untouched. So my wish for you is that you have the throbbing hope that somewhere in the world there's a cafe and within those walls he is there hoping just as much as you and he will look up from that book he is reading and it will slowly begin. Someone will ache for your soul. Wait for them. Y'all ask me questions at michelle at michellecromer.com. Thanks, y'all.